Welcome guys to Bessel Thing and today I'll be with you in a new tutorial. So always this is our spoon. We're gonna swear computer easily and this is our logo for sure. So catch you in the tutorial guys. Bye bye. Welcome guys to this tutorial and today we'll be showing you how to create a search uh, button for your database in Visual Studio 2010 in an alternative way to the search query we've shown you before. So this is our program that we'll start with. I have added here a label, a text box which is text box 1 and a go button. So what we'll be using in this, we'll be using the table binding source in our case table one binding source so double click on the go button and we'll type me dot table one binding source dot filter equals and between two quotations we're gonna type first of all the name of the uh, field that we'll search for okay so let's search for the first name so we'll be typing here first name after this space and then like in capital letters then space and after this we will type a single quote and then after the quotations and we'll type ampersand after this v text box one dot text and after this another ampersand and a double quotations a percentage sign then a single quote and another double quotation okay well guess what that's it okay let's test this out okay first of all I'm going to add a couple of records here I have a couple of records well we'll start by searching for a B let's go so it displays all the first names with a B or starting with a B I mean then we're gonna search for Basil. Oops, Basil. Okay, let's go for this. And here we go. If we deleted this and go, here we go. These are all the records we have. And as always, you can do it in a more professional way to double click on the text box and add that code in the text change it event. So that's it guys and thanks a lot for watching and please follow the link to the source code of this project in our new blog. The link will be in the description and thanks a lot for watching.